What's up guys, this is Steve. How's everybody doing? The NVIDIA Shield TV, guys, is the gift that keeps on giving. Amazing, let me take that back. The best by far Android TV box available. I had this Android TV box since 2015 and it keeps on updating. It's an amazing device, guys, believe me. We had the Oreo update. A lot of us was upset about it. But, you know, I'm not too upset anymore because I know it's only so much they could do and they're working on updates and they continuously listen to us. As long as they listen and they keep on trying to make things better, I'm happy with NVIDIA and they've been doing an amazing job with this NVIDIA Shield TV. This video right now is to talk about GeForce Now Beta, which has been added to the NVIDIA Shield TV and man, it's a serious upgrade. Before we start to talk about it, remember the best way to support me in the channel is simply by giving me the thumbs up, liking the video for me, sharing the video and helping somebody else. And if you're new, definitely subscribe and join the notification squad. Turn those notifications to always so you don't miss anything I upload and you can get it as soon as possible. All right, enough with the foreplay. Let's get it popping, y'all. I'm about to share you I'm about to show you guys some details about the GeForce Now beta and give you guys some of my opinions of it and what I think may happen in the future. So you guys can see I already been messing with it. And man, this beta, I know you guys remember GeForce Now and it wasn't that great. It was okay. You know, it was good, you know, kind of good, but it had got a lot of old titles or stuff we really didn't want. And it was a lot of complaints complaints about that with GeForce now. But this beta is amazing, guys. Let's go right to it. Let's go to the video games. All right. And let's go to some of the games available now. Most popular. Fortnite. <clears throat> Pub. Amazing, guys. Amazing. So... With the GeForce Now beta, it was originally created, well, it was told about us during CES 2017. NVIDIA announced it, that they were going to add GeForce Now so for purchase for people with um, more budgeted PCs or Macs that didn't have a gaming computer, but they could still, you know, play their video games on cloud with GeForce Now, regular Steam games. And man, let's get right to it. I just gotta show you guys this. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go all the way down, and we're gonna go to GeForce Now. Well, there we go. Let's go right here. GeForce Now. You still got those games included that came with the original subscription for free, and it are there is some free stream Steam games you can play also. On GeForce now but look at the catalog now more about 250 games added so far and they said they're gonna add a lot more this kind of um, almost depending almost kind of can eliminate games uh, stream also because if you have bought the game on Steam already and it's available to play here you don't even need your PC. So the way this works, if the game is free, you can play it. If not, you'll have to purchase it. So let's just choose something out the blue. Let's look at Dragon Ball Z. I'm going to hit enter on play. It's streaming unbelievable also man this is unbelievable big move by Nvidia Shield T well by Nvidia this makes the Nvidia Shield TV a definite game changer no PC needed let me turn on my controller well, I just use my keyboard 
right? Connected to your Steam account. If you don't have a Steam account, it's going to ask you, you know, to log into your Steam account or to uh, make one. So if you never did it before, no worries. So right now it's asking me to buy it. it, are, it there are cheaper, cheaper games for $20. There are free games. They don't include the price when, before you press on it. So I don't know for sure. But this is the great thing about this GeForce Now beta. Say I buy this game and it's $60 or I pay $20 for a game. Usually you have to download that game. You know, when I'm using my PC, I have to download that game. It'll be so, so, let's see how much space does it show us the space. System requirements. Trying to see how much space will it take. Not seeing right here. But it'll, it'll be so big. Some of these games are over a gigabyte big. So... What people were worried about if they got a 16 gigabyte ROM shield, that they'll have to go purchase a hard drive, which most of us do already, or they should have purchased the 500 gigabyte Pro. Nope, no worries. Once you purchase a game on the GeForce Now beta, you do not have to download that game. It will play on cloud for you. So, I don't know how to go back. I'm just going to press my home screen. And I'm going to go back to the games. So this is one I purchased recently. I purchased Metal Gear, Metal Gear Solid to show you guys. I paid 20 bucks for it. No downloading needed. I went to uh, play it, push play, and it launched right from cloud. Same thing with some of these free games, Fortnite. I purchased, I've been purchased Injustice 2 in the past. So, I'm going to show you guys my PC. And let you know, this is not game stream, stream. It's actually streaming on cloud. Okay. Going back to my Steam account. Blah, 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 blah. Hit play. It's launching. Download complete because it's streaming right from cloud. So none of that data goes on your video shield TV. And it's running. Again, here's my PC. No game stream. Straight from the shield cloud. Everything's loading the normal way as it would. This is an amazing job. Total game changer. No hiccups. You could play online with other uh, people on Steam. Not popping up yet, but it will. There we go. Battle online against other online players. Amazing. This is amazing. I imagine you will need some good internet for this, guys. I 
I got the volume off also. Loading well. After this, we're going to take a look at some more of the games it has. And then I'm just going to give you my opinion of everything about it. And I know I put it on easy, but I do this for real, for real. I do it. I do it even on, on, on super hard. All right, let's exit all of this, man. Let's go back to the main menu. Showing you guys. Unbelievable, man. All right. I press B and backed all the way out. Let's take a look at all of the games that's on available now for you to play for free or purchase. Big catalog. So I'm just going to go down, click uh, real quick. I know a lot of you guys wanted uh, NBA on the shield. You have the 2Ks now. Far Cry. This will be amazing. If they continue to get new games also, game changer. Man, this is a game changer. Look at this. Witcher two and three man so they said 250 games added and um, some more are coming remember if it's added to this list right here and you usually play it on game stream you don't need your PC no more all right I'm gonna share with you guys my opinion of this well I already told you guys this is a game changer guys this is an unbelievable job by NVIDIA, especially including it on NVIDIA Shield TV. It's like an all-in-one now. It's, it's a complete upgrade towards the last GeForce Now. Um, as far as you can game online against your people, your friends, um, play Steam games. You can also, you don't have to use any of your data on your device because it's on cloud. It's streaming perfect. Um, it's great, guys. Definitely, definitely. Shout out to NVIDIA for this. Definitely great. Let me know what you guys think about it. The only problem I could see about this in the future is the price. It's the price, guys. This definitely, once it comes off beta, I don't see it being the original price that the old GeForce Now was. The old GeForce Now, I believe, was like nine, ten bucks. We're, I'm thinking more. It's gonna be higher than that. So I'm not sure. I haven't seen anything listed about the price. Uh, don't take my word for it, but uh, I can see it, man. And people are gonna pay for this. It's a lot of people without gaming computers who want to play Steam games play Fortnite on the video shield TV now you know this is amazing now definitely amazing this is on man great job of video but let me know what you guys think if you guys have played around with it share your opinions you know definitely comment that's the way we help each other we are a community so people want to hear from more than just me so share your opinions if you have played with this so far, if you haven't, if this is your first time seeing it, let me know what you guys think about it. Also, guys, during Prime a Day, Amazon will be selling the Video Shield, but without the controller for 140. Amazing deal. I heard that the with the controller is 179. So that's still $20 off, but 
amazing deal for the 140 you can get it for the 140 and buy yourself another controller or you can get the one with the controller but this is definite game changer and nvidia is just pushing the nvidia shield tv to the next level and i'm, I'm amazed by this so i want to hear you guys thoughts about this shout out to nvidia thank you for this man amazing job and also the best way to support me in the channel is give me the thumbs up like the video for me share the video let other people see this and uh, also if you're new to this channel man subscribe and click that bell join the notification squad so you're reminded when i upload videos on youtube turn it on always and tune in next time so i can show you how to make the box yours thanks for watching